today we have a problem with our Mercedes that is when we turn on our ignitions on the radiator fan would run at full speed moreover when we turn off our, our engines the fan still won't stop even though we've turned off our ignitions let's work out what's wrong with this car so as you can see the scan result there are plenty of trouble cope regarding to our powertrain control unit which is N127 as consequence this fault also occurs on our radio fans cooling pump as well as the electric grill regarding to the lean communication system before fixing our problems let's take a look at the block diagrams where it demonstrates how the N127 controls our cooling system which use lean C to transfer signal so with this particular PCU on the W205 it controls our sub cooling pump the grill and the fan as you can see this is the whole wiring diagrams of our N127 PCU the lean C through pin 16 controls our cooling system by using parallel circuit connected to this component the front grill motors have four wires two for ground one for power and one for lean signal the fan and cooling pump on the other hand has three wires they has one power one ground and one for lean so now we're going to check these components sequentially so as we have known the N127 use parallel circuit to control our cooling system for our convenient purpose we can measure anywhere as long as this feels easy for us and in my case it would be the fan I've already propped the wire to receive the signal that our N127 sends to the radiator fan to measure lean signal we have to turn on our ignitions as you can see there is no signal in the oscilloscope but the fan is still running at full speed it should mean that signal aren't being sent from the PCU so this might be the result when either our components or N127 has a short circuit now we will unplug the fans and remeasure to see whether the problem comes from it so as we can see we still have a short circuit on our multimeter this means that the problem remains on two other components after checking the front grill we still get the same result that we had with our fan it leads to the final things and that is our coolant pump after bypassing the ground wire to an external wire there aren't any short circuit so we can conclude that the coolant pump has an internal short circuit itself after replacing the coolant pump with a new one we have to turn the ignition on and measure lean signal to make sure that whether our problem is fixed so as you can see the fan is no longer operates as we turn our ignition on and this is the exact lean signal that the N127 used to control the whole cooling system overall today's problem is related to the engine cooling pump which results the PCU to disconnect the lean signal this caused the radiator fan to run as full speed with no control